welcome everybody. Definitely the apartment. Come in. So hey and welcome to this apartment tour of my new apartment. It's actually not that new anymore since I'm living here since almost 4 weeks now. But yeah, for new it's new, something you don't know or something you've never seen of me. It's an 80 meter square apartment, 3.5 rooms. I don't know if you count this as we count it here in Switzerland and your country, but for us it's 3.5 rooms. I would say we just go through it. Here I'm right in front of the entry door to the left. First, it's just a bathroom, nothing too special there, not gonna show you really a bunch of that. Here, second room is my room where I sleep and that's everything I do inside here. You can see it's a pretty, pretty big room for just having my small bed inside. There's not much more to see, there's just yeah, my bed and I sleep inside here. I really like the angled window, it's making it a little bit uh, better. Because actually there's a street not too far away, but it's all coming from the left side. This means that the um, sounds from the streets are getting thrown away by the wall. They do not come through the window. That's a pretty nice detail. Yes, that's everything for this room here. Not really much to see. As you can see here in the entry, we have this long uh, way to go to the uh, kitchen and everything. But first of all, or before we go there, Welcome to my office. The office I told you a lot about that it's a little bit uh, echoing inside here because of having only walls. That's why I bought some plates of foam, cut them out. Don't critic my uh, cuts because they are terrible. But it helps a lot with the echoing because it's not just going on the wall. It's also absorbing a little bit of the sound like this. It's not that echoing inside here anymore. And also a little bit on which one I can see. Just to my neighbors. It's pretty cool as an office. I have enough space. I also have my two guitars here. Um, yeah, which I sometimes use since I'm making a little bit of music as a hobby too. And also my keyboard, which I just bought to learn a bit how to play. That's everything for my office. Again, quick going over my setup. My PC, RTX 3070 and the Ryzen 7 5600X. And some other stuff inside, all in white, completely white build really like my PC like this. I'm gonna give it a little more, a better view. My PlayStation 5, which funny has some eyes on it because uh, when my friends came over for the party for this new apartment, they bought, they brought me some eyes because uh, I don't know, it's funny, I guess. Uh, my two screens, again, one from Asus and one from AOC. Uh, my Rode NT1 a mic my Biodynamics ET77 Pro headphones and also just my LED light and my camera I use for recording. So that's everything for this room here. Also when I'm recording, I'm closing the door, that's why I, behind here also some foam giving me a little bit less echo in general. In the entrance here we have a lot of space with all those cabinets here. There are enough space for jackets and everything so I do not have something really lying around. Then we come to this big room here, which is just, uh, yeah, the room where I eat. I got a big table, like 10, 2 meters 10 long, I guess. Enough space for 8 or maybe even 10 persons, I didn't try that. I got a chimney, which is really cool, I haven't used it yet, but I definitely will. And then also we have the part, have the part here on the left, with my TV and the sofa. Do you call it sofa? I guess it's a sofa. It's really open, it's really much space. You can still see here I have enough space uh, in front of the balcony uh, windows. That's really cool. I like this uh, whole edge, which is all out made of balcony, uh, all out made of windows. Gives it a lot of light in here. Yeah, that's for the living room. Nothing too special here now. I would say we just go outside before I show you the kitchen in the end. You can see that just right in front of me, we also have the forest pretty close. So if I want to go for a walk in the forest, that's pretty close. The balcony goes all around the corner. So over here we have the barbecue with the entry door, or actually the door who goes out of the balcony from the kitchen. I have some plants outside, they already were installed, so I didn't do much, too much here. Then we also have this corner here where we have a little bit more space and also a little room which is just 
Right now I'm just having uh, empty bottles and stuff inside there before giving them back to the seller. But uh, it's just a small room where you can do put in whatever you want to put in. It's pretty cool. So let's say we go back inside. Now we go for the last part of this apartment, which is actually the kitchen. Kitchen is, the kitchen is pretty cool because it first of all it has a door, even though it's just one of those doors here. But for me that's pretty useful because I can just close it and then there's not the whole uh, living room that's smelly when I'm cooking. Here we are in the kitchen, to the left we just have more cabinets and the fridge with a lot of space. Most of that thing is just completely empty because I'm living alone, I do not have this much uh, stuff to put inside. We also got this kitchen here, which just has a lot of space to work on, like... You can see it, there's nothing really you can't do inside here. A lot of space also, uh, yeah, it's a... Uh, how to say, it's not the most modern kitchen, you can see it when I'm going a little bit closer. Those are really old uh, um, cabinets made with uh, out of wood and stuff like that. But I really like it because especially the stone here, it's actually something that doesn't uh, get touched too much. It's still in really good condition and I feel it's not looking really old or something. Yeah, so that's basically it for the whole apartment. You can see also in the kitchen I have the window again. And also the door goes directly to the balcony, which is really, really useful. That's basically for my apartment, as I said before, already um, 80 meters square. Pretty cool really really light flooded especially the older part here also now you can see here on top up there that little uh, hole in the in the in the top of the building which is just uh, I don't know how you're calling this I guess overhead light or something like that it's pretty cool because you actually can see uh, it's letting a lot of light inside and when it rains you can really hear the raindrops dropping on it and it's quite calming I really like that so, and with that, I would say I'll let you go. And I want to say thanks to everybody of you who's watching this channel still and supporting it. I'm Capunator, and I hope to see you back soon for another video. Ciao. Honey, I'm a perfect 10, whoa, whoa.